Hey guys, this guy's asking, can somebody be 33% Norwegian, 33% Swedish, and 33% Danish? We cannot make a human being that's exactly one third of each of those, but we can get somebody who would round to 33%. First, we need three people, one of them to be 100% Norwegian, one to be 100% Swedish, and one to be 100% Danish. And in math terms, I'm going to express them like this. So this person is a 100% Norwegian, zero Swedish, zero Danish. This person is 0% Norwegian, 100% Swedish, 0% Danish. And this guy is 0% Norwegian, 0% Swedish and 100% Danish. This is just the math code for the breakdown of their heritage. So we're going to have this Norwegian person and this Swedish person have a baby. To figure out how much Norwegian, we're going to do 1 plus 0 divided by 2, which is 1 half. To find out how much Swedish, we'll do 0 plus 1 divided by 2. That's also 1 half. And then to find out how much Danish is in them, we'll do 0 plus 0 divided by 2, which is 0. So this baby of these two people is half Norwegian, half Swedish. And now for this Danish person, let's bring in another Norwegian person and let's have them have a baby. To calculate this baby's heritage, we do 0 plus 1 divided by 2, which is 0.5. 0 plus 0 divided by 2, which is 0. And 1 plus 0 divided by 2, which is 0.5. So this baby is half Norwegian and half Danish. These two kids will grow up and then they're going to have a baby. This is that baby's breakdown. We do 0.5 plus 0.5 divided by 2, which is 0 0.5. 0 0.5 plus 0 divided by 2, which is 0 0.25. And 0 plus 0 0.5 divided by 2, which is 0.25. This baby right here would end up being 50% Norwegian, 25% Swedish, and 25% Danish. So this person has all three heritages, but they're not exactly 33-33. 33, 33 just yet. Next, let's take these four people and let's bring in four more people. And we'll just keep up the pattern. Norwegian, Swedish, Danish, Norwegian, Swedish, Danish, Norwegian, Swedish. And we'll stop there. And then we'll have these two have a baby. And then these two can have a baby. And then these two kids can grow up and they'll have a baby. And all this is calculated the same way. These two babies will grow up at the same time. And then they're going to have a baby. And it comes out to this right here. Half of 0.5 plus 0.25 is 0.375 and so on. This baby right here is going to be 37.5% Norwegian, 37.5% Swedish, and 25% Danish. We're getting closer to the 33, 33, 33. Next, if we do the same thing with 16 people, it'll come out into this right here, which gives us these numbers, which we're getting closer to 33%, but we're still not there yet. Here it is starting with 32 people, and we end up with this right here. So we're getting 34.375 Norwegian, 34.375 Swedish, and 31.25 Danish. We're getting really close. Let's try it with 64 people. So here it is with 64 people right here, and if we zoom in, we can see this gives us closer, but we're still not to 33, 33, 33. Here's starting with 128 people. Let's zoom in and see how that turns out. Oh, we're getting really close now, 33.59s and 32.81s. Let's try 256 people. So here's our 256 people right here. And up here is the generation that we're interested in right here. Okay, they all have 33s now, but this one's 33.5 where these are 33.2. Maybe if we get 512 people, we can get it down even closer. So here it is with 512 people. If we zoom in on what we're interested in, and here it is, I think we found it. This person would be 33.4% Norwegian, 33.4% Swedish, and 33.2% Danish. All three of those would round to 33%. And this only took 512 people to begin with, and it looks like about nine generations.